Hi there, students. Savvy. Savvy. Okay, this word can be a noun, can be an adjective, or it could be a verb. Let's see, savvy is talking about knowing about things, knowing about something. So, are you tech savvy? Do you know about technology? Do you know how tech works? Are you able to repair it? Um, this guy is very street savvy. Yeah, he learnt uh, how to do things from the School of Hard Knocks or the University of Life. Yeah, the University of Life teaches you how to be street savvy, to know what to do, to know the right things to do to avoid trouble. Okay, so both of those are e examples of savvy as a noun. He's a very savvy person. He knows a lot. There, there you have it as an adjective. He's very knowledgeable uh, about things. He's got a lot of practical knowledge. Um, young people today are very savvy about using the about using the digital world, whereas older people like me are a lot less savvy in handling this. Um, a, he's a very savvy politician. He's a savvy buyer. Yeah, he's a savvy consumer. He knows where to um, buy, buy things properly. The savvy shopper will know how to get good value for money. A savvy traveller knows how to avoid the tourist traps. Okay, so... Um, if you describe someone as having savvy or somebody as savvy, you know you think they have a good understanding of something, good practical knowledge. Um, so his political savvy puts him in a very good um, position, understanding, perception, the grasp of something. Um, okay, so yeah, he's very savvy. And then as a verb. Um, do you do, uh, do you do you savvy that um, tomorrow is going to be a holiday? Be careful, savvy. Do you understand? I think as a verb, it's probably less common, but it, it certainly, it's certainly certainly used um, as a ver as a verb as well. Um, do you savvy? Um, do you savvy what's what's happening uh, in this matter? So savvy, well-informed, shrewd, perceptive. Um, a uh, savvy Westminster insider knows what's happening in the world of uh, politics. Um, a media-savvy journalist understands how journalism works. Um, I wish I had more financial savvy or business savvy practical understanding on how to use this. Do you savvy? Do you know what I mean? Do you understand? Do you comprehend? Um, I'm going to be a bit late t tomorrow, savvy? So if the boss comes around, tell him I'm in the toilet or hidden or find, find a good excuse. Okay, so savvy, it's talking about understanding. It's talking about knowing uh, how to do things, being smart, having the ability to make good judgment, being shrewd, astute, sharp-witted, quite acute, intelligent. Yeah, you know what's up. You um, know what what's happening and the right thing, the right thing to do. Savvy? Okay, so um, I think by this point you've probably got a lot of language savvy or English language savvy, because. Uh, my videos are normally fa fairly um, complicated. Okay, so formality, savvy. Mm, I think I'm going to give it a 3.5 in formality, savvy. Um, use it in an informal conversation, a semi-formal conversation, maybe just street savvy, business savvy. Mm, I don't know, actually. I think I might even uh, accept business savvy or tech savvy uh, in something uh, in a semi-formal writing. 
Um, it, it, it's a it, it's a good phrase, although savvy as the verb, very very informal. I think business savvy, tech savvy. I'm going to bump it up to a 4.5 informality. Um, and then the origin, the origin is very easy. It comes from saber in Spanish or in Portuguese uh, to know, which comes from Latin sapere. Um, to the wise, intelligent, a sapient human being, Homo sapiens, who knows all sorts of things, maybe. So, enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. Salve.